Memphis police say one person was taken to the hospital, but they should be okay. WRG's Melissa Moon joins us now live from that scene on airways near Ketchum. And Melissa, what's the latest out there? Well, as you can see behind me, the barriers are back up tonight, and that wasn't the case earlier today. Fans who came here to pay their respects could go right up to the building. They were writing on the wall. They were leaving flowers, stuffed animals, balloons there. But uh, this afternoon, someone was shot standing in the, on the sidewalk outside this building. Uh, someone said that someone drove by. They fired what sounded like two to three shots, and then a police officer who happened to be here went immediately chasing after that vehicle. Police say they immediately to detained two people and then a third person after that pursuit, pursuit that ended at Curran, Washington, following a crash and a chase there. That person was taken into custody. Now, according to witnesses here, they don't think that person was targeted. It was just a random shooting. And here's what one witness said happened. When, when it happened, uh, my, my, uh, my, me and my friends hit the ground, everybody else hit the ground, and um, um, another guy was hit in the inner thigh. He's been rushed to the hospital, so uh, a lot of the other people took off, and, and, and then the police that were here, they gave chase to the car that did the shoot. And again, three people were detained. We're told that there were about 30 to 40 people out here paying their respects when that happened. And since all this, Memphis police have come back and they have brought a sky cop camera out here that will likely stay here throughout the evening. Now, someone told me that there was a memorial planned here at 6 o'clock tonight. Don't know if that is still going to happen. In fact, police are getting ready to move us back a little bit as well. Reporting live in South Memphis, Melissa Moon, WREG News Channel 3.